I hate it here. Hey y'all, so it's Tuesday. I don't even know what today's date is. It's the 16th, so um, if you are not new here, you know Tuesdays are very hectic for me. Uh, so yeah, it is um, like 6 or 7 p.m. So I've been working like all day and I am just beat. <laughs> I'm tired, guys. So a couple things happened today. So um, I was telling you guys that my best friend and I were going to go to Seattle this weekend um, to go to the Glossier store. But we've decided to postpone our trip and reschedule it for January. Um, it's just a lot of back-to-back -back travel with the holidays coming up. Kind of completely forgot that Thanksgiving is literally next week. Um, I feel kind of ill-prepared to be going out of town this weekend. And you guys, I have like a lot of work to do. So um, I'm glad she was understanding and we were just on the same page about it. So yeah, but... And more exciting news, I finally got a new phone. So, um, remember I was telling you guys that I was trying to order an iPhone 13 Pro in gold. And they were telling me that if I ordered it, it wouldn't have been available. It wasn't going to ship out until November 30th to like December 14th. So, I would have had the phone, which is insane. But my mama, shout out to her, she found one for me in Jacksonville at T-Mobile. Um, so she shipped it to me. She bought it. Um, I sent her the money to buy it and she shipped it to me right here in Atlanta. So I just got it today in the mail. Um, we did overnight. She just got it yesterday because I was like, I need a phone. Which is lit because on my other phone, which I have to be pretty delicate with, you guys know, I got my screen repaired on this phone back in July. Um, and literally the glass is separating from the device. It is very ghetto. The guy who fixed my phone, I've been communicating with him about fixing this. Um, his communication is extremely lackluster. He did say that he was like recently in surgery or something like that, which I completely understand. But he also said that he would be able to fix it by the end of the day on Saturday. Today is Tuesday. Have not heard from him since then. Um, but luckily, my mama found me a phone, so it's all good. Now, um, I have to be careful with this phone because it's been like shutting off all day, which it does very often. It just shuts off. So I want to go ahead and like transfer or set up my new phone. I'm so hungry. Set up my new phone. Um, and I got gold. Ooh, wow. It's like I literally just opened the box and it was just, see? <laughs> It was just right there. Let me be a little bit more careful, y'all. Um, I got gold. I was gonna opt for white. It's just all white and like the sides are silver. But they were able to get me a gold one. So um wow. It's so nice. Let me see the size difference. Cause I have um no, they're about the same size, and this is what the case. I have an eleven pro. This phone must have been returned. No, no, because the seals were on it. I was only saying that because it was just like, there's nothing. Is there a backing on it? No, there is like a back over it, but there's nothing on the screen. I guess this is what was supposed to be on screen. Let me be quiet because y'all know I can get very ahead of myself, but turning it on. So I just kind of want to set it up manually. So um, I did order a case, or I ordered two cases for this phone actually off Amazon. I just ordered them yesterday, so they'll be here tomorrow with Amazon Prime. Um, I could have did like today. It would have been like an extra $3, and I just was like, I mean, it's just $3, but it's okay. Like, I can wait. It's okay. Um, excuse me. So, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and set up my phone and yeah nothing else is really going on today y'all i just um wanted to pop on because i wanted to let you guys know that i finally got a new phone because y'all know it's been very very ghetto 
Restore from iCloud backup. Restore from Mac or PC. I'm not going to lie. I don't want nothing out of that phone in here. Specifically just the pictures and videos. I don't want that stuff in this phone. So I'm just going to say don't transfer. Because I want to set this up as a whole new phone on its own. I don't really want what's in that phone. To be completely honest with you. Y'all I am starving. I am so hungry. After I set this up. I got to go get some food. Like. I gotta go get some food. Do I want light or dark mode? I'm a, I'm a light mode kind of person. I don't ever really go dark mode. What do you guys do? Like, tell me in the comments. Are you more like light mode or dark mode? Y'all, I know that I'm like tired because I even like canceled my um lash appointment that was supposed to be tomorrow. Yeah, I I didn't cancel it. I rescheduled it because I just want a fresher um. I want to look fresh for Thanksgiving more so. I was, you know, going out of town this weekend. So I wanted like a fresh set for that. But since I'm not going anymore, like I'm okay with just not having. Um, I swear if these photos are in here, I'm going to be very upset. Because already the emails are connected, which it's my Apple iCloud. So like I feel that, but I would have just set this phone up tomorrow if that phone wasn't doing the most today. Like literally y'all, maybe like an hour ago, it completely shut off. And so I had to do like the reset thing on it, uh, like the soft reset where you like hit the up button, hit the down button and then hold like the side. And um, I don't know, just. There has got to be an easier way to do this. Welcome to Apple. Calls are recorded for evaluation. You guys, I've decided and to improve context. I've decided to call Apple for assistance because I don't know what I'm doing. I can't do this on my own like I thought I could. So I'm going to talk to Apple and figure it out. And I will check in with y'all a little bit later. What are you barking about? Nothing exactly. I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, y'all, so talk to Apple. She was able to help me like set it up as far as me. I don't, I don't want like the photos from like these phones on that phone. I like fresh starts. So um, she was saying in order for me to actually use this device as my phone, I'm gonna have to contact my carrier or provider, whatever, and that's T-Mobile. So it's not late, it's only like 6.35. So I'm actually gonna go to the store because calling them, I don't know. Remember I was telling y'all, I don't have the best experiences with T-Mobile's customer service. Not that they're like rude. It's just like, they just don't be knowing what they're talking about sometimes. And I'm on my parents' plan still. Like I ain't never leave my mama plan. Um, so I don't know like what, I have access to certain things, but I, would, I don't want to like be shifting around in her account online. So I would just rather go get in-person help at the store so that's what I'm gonna go do since it's still kind of early um not that it's early clearly y'all know it's not early but you know it ain't that late so I'm gonna go ahead and head up to T-Mobile so I can get this taken care of and then I'm actually gonna go to Target first to get a case yeah and then I'm gonna go to um T-Mobile so Yes, let's go. Okay, y'all, so I went to T-Mobile first because of the time and they closed at eight and it's like seven. So I just wanted to get in and out before they actually close. So they activated my new phone. So I am back in business. Now I'm at Target because I still want to get a case. And I know y'all are probably like, Janae, your case will be here tomorrow. Why are you buying a case? Because sis, between then and now, I don't want no accidents, okay? The first time I shattered my phone screen, it was like nighttime like this and I was walking Deandra out and I had Georgia and she like kicked the phone out of my hand. It went like flying. Okay, so I don't want nothing happening between tonight and tomorrow when I receive my phone cases from Amazon. I just, I don't know. It just don't feel right having this phone completely naked like this. So I'm gonna go on Target. I'm gonna stay focused. I'm only getting a case. I ordered a screen protector off of Amazon too. So I'm not going to get a screen protector out of here. Just a case. Okay. That's it. I slept to the plan. All I got 
was a phone case. So I got this little pink one by Heyday. I don't like this brand of phone case and now I remember why. Cause I had one for my old phone. There's like no covering for the bottom. I wish I had another case to show you what I mean. I don't know, but usually like there would be something to cover this part, but there isn't on this case. But it's okay because this is temporary. So um, yeah, I'm really excited though. I got my new phone together. I don't have to change this um, lock screen because this is just one of the like standard ones that come, you know, with Apple. But usually I have like something inspirational on here, like a picture of Beyonce. Um, and then like on my home screen, I'll have something that I want. Like on my last phone, I had like one of the cars that I really like, which is a Porsche McCann. And like the trunk was full of like bouquets and bouquets of flowers. So I gotta try to find that picture again because I found it on Pinterest. I don't think I put it on a board, but um, yeah, so, come here, mama. So yeah, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and get ready for bed. I do have like two things I gotta work on for work. I need to get it done before tomorrow in Georgia with her raggedy ponytail. Y'all, she is getting groomed Monday. I know I've been saying for a while that she was getting groomed. That she was getting groomed, but it's gonna happen in real life on Monday and I cannot wait because baby looks very, um, yeah. And I saw this really cute TikTok that me and her have to do. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. It's to Doja Cat's, um, what's that song? I think it's called, let me see. Why don't I know this? Y'all know I love Doja Cat. Up and down, yeah, up and down. So yeah, I'm probably gonna try to film that, to film the first half of it tomorrow since I got my new phone, because you gotta go from looking like busted to looking like you got your life together. So once we have our new hair, New outfits, new nails, lashes again. We're gonna jump into the new into the new us. That's how it go, right, mama? Yeah. But yeah, y'all, I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Oh, hey y'all. So today's Wednesday. I'm looking a little crazy because first of all, look at my eyebrow. <laughs> how on makeup because like I went out earlier today. Um, and I had to go to work, but I took a nap on my couch. Like I wrapped my hair up just because I knew I wanted to film later and I didn't want it to get like too crazy looking. And when I woke up, my eyebrow looked like it's spreading across my face. I brushed my hair back because it was like forward right here. And then I still have like a lot of demarcation, y'all. But um, I'm gonna put this back and clean it up. So, what was I finna say? Yeah, what was I saying? <laughs> oh, am I losing my mind? So it's um Wednesday. I keep wanting to say Thursday for some reason. It's not Thursday, but my Amazon package came with my cases in it. So I got two cases. So I thought this was gonna look different. I thought this was gonna look a little different. So I got this like clear one and it's supposed to have like, well I guess it does kind of have the like sharp edges. I don't know why I thought it looked a little more sharp than this. It's still cute though. But remember last night when I was telling y'all that like this case doesn't have anything that covers the speakers and like the charging port. This is what I was talking about. Like normally there's something that covers that whole thing. So that's one case I got. It's probably one I'm gonna end up using first. And then the other one I got is actually like an eggshell color kinda. Just something neutral. It looks, it doesn't look the same way in person as it does on the cat, on the, uh, why was I about to say calendar? Y'all, I'm going through it the camera it looks a little different right here than it does on the camera but i'm going to take this off because i think i want to use the clear one y'all i'm so happy to have a new phone I have no idea 
<laughs> that noise. <laughs> okay. It's a really snug and secure fit. So it just looks like this. I don't know why I thought the edges would be like sharper, but this is cute. I need to clean the back of the phone or something, something on there. But anyway, so I'm about to go to the grocery store. I want to um, make some honey sriracha wings tonight and Brussels sprouts. I know that sounds like a strange combination or maybe it doesn't, but I wanted some wings and I don't want like fries on the side. I was like, what can I have on the side other than fries? Um, and so I looked on Pinterest and I saw like people were recommending the, um, like Georgia, you okay? She, she hit the coffee table. Uh, recommending like Brussels sprouts, like roasted Brussels sprouts. So I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I cannot believe my eyebrow look chunky like this. Like, first of all, y'all, I don't necessarily conceal under my eyebrows when I fill them in. I don't know why I used to, but I like stopped. Um, it was just like, I don't know. But <laughs> maybe I need to because Maybe that would not have happened. But again, it happened when I was asleep, so it was really nothing I can do about that. So I'm putting the other case back in its packaging. Almost feeling like I don't even need it, but. It is what it is. I'm trying to decide. Let me know what you guys use to like sit your um, phones up in your car. Like I have, uh, I used to have like a pop socket on the back of my phone and I would like, I had like the little pop socket thing. I don't know, it goes in the vent and you just like sit it in there like that. But with it being cold, my phone ends up sitting right in front of the vent and I have the heater on. So my phone is like overheating. So that's a problem. Um. So yeah, I was thinking about getting one of the things that's just like magnetic. But of course, you have to put it like on the back of your case. I wouldn't want to put it on the back of this case. So maybe I could like put it on the inside of the case instead. That way it doesn't have to be exposed and I can just do it like that. Or I can just get something with like a clamp. I don't know. Give me some recommendations. Of course, I've looked on Amazon to like weigh out my options, but I still want to know like what you guys use. So yeah. Um, so yeah, next what I'm going to do is wash dishes because I'm going to cook tonight, but there's a few dishes in the sink already. I don't know if y'all are like me, but I don't like to cook with dishes in the sink. I don't know. I cook and clean at the same time. I'm one of those people who can't like, I just can't function in mess, which is why I am constantly, you know, what did I come in here for? Oh, I came here for my house shoes, but they're actually out here. I'm just one of those people who can't like function in mess. So when I'm cooking, I'm like washing dishes at the same time. But in this particular situation, I'm gonna uh, wash these few leftover dishes from last night. I think like we had like some ice cream and one of George's bowls is in here. It's just like a few dishes. So I'm gonna get that out of the way before I go to the grocery store to just pick up. The only thing I need from the grocery store, um, I need the Brussels sprouts. I made a list, where is it? I need to get some chicken, I need the Brussels sprouts, I need some garlic and some Creole seasoning because I'm out. So, am I out? I think I'm out, but let me just double check. Yeah, I'm out. I have enough sriracha. I'm gonna go ahead and take it out now. I told y'all I love sriracha. Um, I have enough honey for certain. And if this is not enough, I have another um, jar right there. So I'll just go ahead and take that out now. Um, yeah. While I wash the dishes, I'm gonna watch a YouTube video. Somebody just uploaded. Several people have uploaded, but somebody who I really like just uploaded. And I'm saying, I'm, I'm kind of just speaking that into existence. I don't know if anybody uploaded for real. I'm just saying that somebody got a new video up that I can look at for sure. Um, Speaking of uploads and videos, y'all, I feel like I've been MIA. Um, Cause before Vlogtober, I was about to say Vlogmas. Before Vlogtober, 
I was only uploading twice a week. Like I would do like a vlog and a different type of content. Like it wouldn't be like a vlog, but Vlogtober got me in the habit of vlogging every day and I was producing like two day vlogs. So it would be like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and like Friday, Saturday or something like that. But you guys know, cause I know y'all are sick of hearing me talk about it. I just want to reiterate it because I may have like some new subscribers or you know, maybe you guys didn't watch something, I don't know, but work has me in chopo. So I haven't been able to vlog like, you know, I quite wanted to or even like create some of the videos that I told you guys I was looking forward to making. It just hasn't happened. But this is um this is the last week of me making that excuse. I'm definitely gonna vlog this weekend. I got a super exciting weekend ahead of me. Um, Thanksgiving is next week, so I'll be with my family again. Um, what else is happening? I got a hair appointment this Friday. I have a nail appointment. Like we got some maintenance going on. George is getting groomed. Like, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be coming out of that. I was creating holiday content for work type thing. Um, and I'll be able to have like some more freedom to like do what I want to do again. Um, so yeah, so I guess I'm just trying to like, hold on, I'm too far away from y'all, one second. And I'm making a lot of noise. I just want to like keep y'all updated because I don't want to become one of those people who's just like inconsistent. Um, cause I'm not trying to be inconsistent. I just, I want to, you know, prioritize rest and I don't want to overwork myself because then y'all are not going to get quality content. Like that vlog I put out for y'all, um, when like I was in Jacksonville with my family and like my daddy was like ordained, I was so happy for all those moments to come together. But that vlog felt really like incomplete. Like I don't even know if I really told like a story, but I know we friends and we family here, so y'all are like okay with it, but I just don't want to get in the habit of giving y'all like shitty content for lack of better terms. So this is gonna be the last now. The vlog, okay, I'm uploading a vlog tomorrow on Thursday. That vlog kind of ghetto too. Okay? So forgive me in advance. This vlog gonna be a little ratchet. Just like and what I mean is just that it's just all over the place. But Content coming up is gonna be a lot better. We're about to get into vlog miss. Vlog miss. I got an intro made. It's supposed to be ready tomorrow. I'm super excited to share that with you guys. Um, I'm not in the intro, it's just text-based, just really like classic, but it's still very me. Um but yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know what was going on because we are steadily hitting milestones which I so greatly greatly appreciate oh and I did a giveaway in my October favorites I hope y'all can hear me this water is on I did a giveaway in the October favorites so um I ordered the earrings for my winner I'm going to um reach out to her and just confirm that she you know just get her to like accept the gift and everything before I announce who she is um just in case because I did the last giveaway I did there was someone who entered and she actually won and when I reached out her Instagram like she had deactivated it or something so I couldn't get a hold of her so I had to choose a different winner and that's okay but I just want to um you know reach out and connect before but to everybody who entered that giveaway because a lot of y'all didn't which let me know two things. Either y'all didn't want the earrings, which is fine, or y'all didn't watch the whole video, which is also fine, I guess. I would prefer for you guys to watch the whole video because you're supposed to, but you know, I ain't gonna act like, I don't even, I don't even have to say it. I ain't gonna, I'm just not gonna act like. <laughs> but yeah, thank you to everyone who entered that giveaway. We have tons of giveaways coming up. I ain't gonna say tons, we got a few, okay? We got a few giveaways coming up in Vlogmas, during Vlogmas, so make sure you're subscribed, make sure you're watching videos in full because the um, entry rules will be very sporadic. They won't always be at the end, they'll never be at the beginning of the video, know that. They won't always be at the end of the video, it might be somewhere in the middle, it might only be in the description box, it might be in a pinned comment, you know, it might be, 
it could be a lot of different places, but just, just you know, I'm excited for the things that I have planned for Vlogmas. I'm excited to create content and just get back on my routine, y'all, because, ooh, child, it had gotten a little ghetto. But enough of me running my mouth, because I have been running my mouth now for 13 minutes. Oh, my God. I'm going to turn on the video, wash these dishes, and go to Publix. picked up some cookies too and I didn't necessarily need those but I only picked up what I needed and I'm super proud of myself because I did not forget to bring my reusable bag with me because I was telling y'all I have so many of those things and I'd like never use them um so I'm trying to make it my business to actually use them so I picked up Brussels sprouts um some olive oil spray I didn't realize that the Pam olive oil spray was like so expensive like she's almost six dollars this one was like 379 Bertoli Bertoli or Bertoli um, however you pronounce it this is the one I picked up I told y'all I needed some Creole seasoning so I got this one um, Zara's has one too but the one that they had on the shelf it was like damaged and it was the only one so I left it alone picked up some blue cheese I'm normally a ranch girl, but for some reason I feel like these wings are gonna be good with like blue cheese. Um, I was out of garlic powder, so I got some more of that. And then the chicken is in this bag. I have to clean it and cut it. And then um, if y'all have a Publix near you or this brand in general, Alyssa's, they have these like vegan oatmeal cookies. They are so good so picked up some of those so i'm gonna go ahead and start cooking it is 5 30 um so i don't want to wait like too late i feel like something's a piece of hair or something is like sitting right on my nose it's like tickling me i don't want to wait too late to start cooking so i'm gonna go ahead and start now i need to try or not try but i need to find my tripod my little handheld when i had it earlier I don't know what happened to it. Um, hmm. Huh. But anyway, um, of course, I'm going to turn YouTube back on while I cook. Earlier when I was washing dishes, I was watching Colleen Diaz. I think that's how you pronounce it. Yeah, Colleen Diaz. And so, um, ooh, Asia and I just uploaded something new. Her current favorites on Amazon. So I'm going to watch that. Um, that should be good while I cook. Oh wow, the focus was very much off. Y'all, it's like a piece of hair or something. Like, what is it? I like feel it. It's tickling me. I don't know what that's about. Um, where is my tripod? I know I took it off the camera before I left, but I don't know if I still took it to the car with me or what I did with this. So basically I need to go check the car. I was not trying to go back outside, but I guess I'll check the car so I can carry on with my night. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, y'all, so I have cooked and ate dinner. Um, it's 7.57, so not late at all. I'm about to walk Georgia so she can potty for the night. And then when I come back in, I have to clean up a little bit, take a shower, and finish editing a vlog. So um, I'm going to wrap up this day and I will see y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, um, today's Thursday. It is 5.40, so it's later. It ain't late, but it's later. Um, I feel like it's dark, not to mention my um, hat is giving me shadow, but I refuse to take my hat off, y'all. I have a hair appointment in the morning because I'm over the bun, okay? It's time for the bun to go. She gotta go. Um, I'm sitting here watching Amber Martin's new vlog. Love her so much. I'm so happy she's creating content again. She's literally one of my favorites for sure. Um, so I'm watching her new vlog and, um, I'm about to do an unboxing for work. Um, oh goodness. However, also my Sephora order came in. So I'm really excited about this. I'm not gonna open it in this video because I want to do like a whole video about what I got from Sephora because I did also go to the store and get some stuff too, including this uh, reusable shopping tote during the sale. So I'm excited because my um, when I made my order, ooh, when I made my order, they were saying that it wasn't gonna come until um, like it wasn't gonna ship out until November 26th. So I was a little in my feelings cause I was just like, I'm not gonna get my stuff in time. Like it's not gonna be relevant anymore by the time I get my stuff. Well, of course I could have, I mean, it doesn't matter, but I wanted to, you know, create a video during the time for the sale and all of that. But now I can just do a regular Sephora haul and I can still of course mention that I got it during the um, savings event and show you guys what I got. Cause I'm really excited. I got a lot of stuff that I've never tried before um, in this particular round. Last time I did, we did the sale, what was it like in spring? I bought stuff that I hadn't tried before, but I also just kind of replenished a lot of stuff that I already use. This time I decided to try new things. So I'm really excited about all the things I got. Can't wait to show y'all. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do this unboxing before it gets dark and um well darker because y'all know it gets dark so early now that it's like daylight savings it feels different it feels different this year it's like i'm more tired than usual you know and i've been seeing people of course like post about that and say like this da this daylight savings must have like melatonin in it or something because it does feel different. It feels like it's getting darker way sooner than usual. Like, I don't know, I'm still, I'm, it's still taking some getting used to y'all. But um, yeah, I just wanted to pop in and say hello. I do have something else down here that I wanna open with y'all. I, I, I told y'all I randomly became like a sunglasses girl. Um, so I got these sunglasses from this black owned brand that I discovered on TikTok actually. It's called Rachel Renee. I probably should have like created a whole TikTok for this because wow, this packaging is so nice. Like these are sunglasses and they're just in a box. I can read, I can repackage it. Yes, oh my goodness, this is so cute guys. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all and I'm gonna repackage it. Wait. These are not the sunglasses I ordered. Okay. 
This is not what I ordered, y'all. Why does this happen to me so much? This is what they sent me. This is not what I ordered. Now I gotta go to the website, see? Highly, y'all. <laughs> if you're not new here, you know, you know, this happens to me often. Oh my gosh. I'm going to go on. Oh my goodness, y'all. I'm so aggravated. I just want to show you guys what I actually ordered because that's this is definitely not. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I ordered Charlie, which looks like this. Okay, I'm back. So I'm not going to be upset. I mean, I'm annoyed, but it just is what it is. I know things happen. It's just like, why does this always happen to me? It could absolutely be a sign that I need to stop shopping, which I do and will soon. But just generally speaking, like when I order something, I expect to get what I order. Like this is not, this is like not what I ordered. I would, not to say like these are ugly. This is just not my style. I would never order this. So um, I reached out and told them that I didn't receive what I ordered and just like, what can we do to fix that? Um, but in the meantime, super cute packaging, like the sunglasses come with a sleeve, come with care instructions, a little like cleansing toilet and everything. So presentation is definitely like A1, but like you gotta be more careful when you're like, I don't wanna make any assumptions. I know running a small business is hard. I used to work for one for a very long time. Um, and when there's just a lot of like orders coming in, and the thing is we had overhead and online. So I know how hectic it can get but you have to, have to, have to pay attention to people's orders because you won't always run into a customer as understanding as like me or forgiving as me. Like someone can be super rude and like ask them, like instead of reaching out, they'll just post like so-and-so sent me this and this is not what I ordered. You know, just like find any reason to like go on the internet and be rude. And I mean, I am talking about it here with y'all, but this is my safe space and I'm not saying anything mean. I'm just telling the truth. <sighs> Lord. Okay. So let me go ahead and do this unboxing and then, um, I don't really have a lot planned for the rest of the day or night or whatever. Cause it's definitely like evening. Um, I am in the middle of like, I've been trying to, oh, it uploaded y'all. Okay, so maybe we'll have a late night vlog up because I have been trying to upload this vlog all day. I've started over like at least three times or just like had a few of them like uploading at the same time because the process was just taking forever. This last one finally uploaded. So let me see what time is it? It's, it's 5.51. And it's still checking for like ad suitability. I'm gonna just, the video, it'll just go live tomorrow. As long as everything is like fine and dandy with the upload tonight, it can just go live tomorrow. I, I would rather do that than have like a super late upload that doesn't really perform well because it was supposed to be up. Ideally, I would have liked this vlog to have been live at like two o'clock. So when I get back on track, what I usually do is upload my videos like the night before to YouTube, allow it to upload, process, all that stuff, excuse me, and then it'll go live the following day. But y'all, I've been, you know, y'all are sick of hearing me saying this, but I'm a little bit off right now. So um, it's been like editing and uploading the same day for me. And I know that can take a long time to do. So you come into issues like this, but... Mm -hmm. I would have liked for this to have gone up at like 2 p.m. But it's okay. It'll just go live tomorrow. So 
no big deal no big deal
but yeah i'm gonna get off this camera rambling i'm in this stupid atlanta traffic per usual <sighs> i hate it here not here in atlanta here in traffic hey y'all i'm home so i ended up getting a tropical smoothie so i just got a, um chicken pesto wrap some chips like some of my favorite chips and a smoothie and it's cranberry and it's so crazy because like a few years ago when not a few years ago y'all it's been a decade at this point but when i was in high school i used to go to um tropical smoothie all the time and they had um a smoothie called cranberry crush or cranberry crunch i can't remember but if this tastes anything like that one because they discontinued it i'm going to be so excited and the straw is edible so that's interesting so let's see Oh my god, it's just as good as I remember. This one has like mint in it, but things like cranberry, strawberry, and something else. But I'm gonna eat my food and a wine, and I'll check in with y'all later. This is a cool girl. That was a miracle. She looks like it's in it. That is my girl. Why am I trying to sip this like it's water? Are you ready? Okay, ready? Yeah, okay. You know we got to do it a hundred years time. Yeah, yeah. for like thumbnails. Yes. Yes, yeah. <laughs> alright. Are we cheering again? Yeah. That's a lot, Chelsea. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I can't listen to another man, so I'm <laughs> <laughs>